We've come up on our second day to a village just above Kathmandu, which I hope you can see in the distance. And uh, in, you know, you'll have read about uh, half a million or so houses destroyed in rural areas. And this is, uh, we've come to one of the first villages outside Kathmandu. And this is exactly what it, what it looks like. This family's house has been completely destroyed. Um, luckily, they were all out in the fields. Uh, tilling at the time, so they survived. And what they've done is they've recovered a lot of the uh, their old roofing material and very quickly made a uh, temporary uh, temporary shelter. But this uh, this um, damage is is just dreadful, um, and I think uh, it's clear that not only have they lost all of their house, but they would have lost most of the contents as well. Explaining how the family uh, managed to build a very quick temporary shelter um, using the old roofing materials and uh, in terms of why Health Age selected this particular house, it's, uh, it's because uh, our, our criteria has been houses where older people are living and uh, you can see uh, that the lady of the house is, uh, and, uh, that's why we Very important for me to come and see firsthand the work that our, our staff and our great team and partners are doing in Kathmandu. You know, we've been here now two days, heard stories of great courage, great commitment on behalf of our staff and partners who more or less put to one side all of the personal trauma, the damage to their own homes, etc. and very quickly came back to work for Help Age to uh, help older people across the country affected by this emergency. I'd also like to thank um, people across the world who've donated through our network partners to our work, donors to Age International, to AARP, to Help Age USA, to Help Age Deutschland, to Help Age Spain. Once again, there's been a, a great effort raising funds across the world. And these funds are going to be spent in uh, villages like this one, putting, um, you know, making a small contribution to what's going to be a very long and difficult uh, path to recovery. This has been a terrible disaster, but as, uh, as Chief Exec of Help Age, it's made me very proud to come here and to hear firsthand from men and women who've already benefited from the work that we're doing and uh, to, to know that uh, the team here is, is, is focused and skilled to really make a positive impact over the next couple of years here. Thank you.